target present. Notification system faulty. Security panel is unpowered. Unable to activate diagnostic equipment. Oh, okay. Well, let me start by saying why, why must life be so confounding? Ah, oh my god! Well, at least we figured it out and we can continue our, you know, journey in this uh, facility of that synthetics. But uh, welcome back, my friends. Welcome to the fall. So, well, I figured out something. It seems that that stupid droid that was hanging out in there was the key to continue our journey. So, he just make a clicky clicky on the other panel and I'm not sure what else that we need to do. I guess I would figure out the way to interact with it. Seems like not. No, no network interface. Well, I saw you there, you make something else. But, uh, let's talk to our friend here. Or she... Or he has something to say. Working together today, we create a more efficient... Arid? Maybe not. Are you okay? Maybe, maybe not. I am not a Divesticon product. You have no jurisdiction do again. over me. Infraction. No target present. Notification system faulty. Security panel is unpowered. Unable to activate diagnostic equipment. Okay. So it says that the panel has no power. Maybe we have to find a way to power it up. I think nothing to that is gonna change. Uh, so maybe we have to find a power source for the panel. I keep thinking this TV is very suspicious. Or maybe not. Hmm. So there's supposed to be a way to acquire power. What would it be? Because otherwise I'm going to be stuck in this puzzle until I get old. And I die from something, and I won't be able to continue playing this game. And then, and then, meh. come on, come on. There has to be a way. What? Oh wait, 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 wait a second. I see you there. Uh -huh. <laughs> was that something good or bad, huh? Tell me it was good. I see the cable. That should be our source of power. Maybe? Yes? Alright. Okay, so now what? I cannot. Maybe we have to make that. Oh wait. Check. Uh, okay. No. Yeah. We have to make that robot to get access to the panel in order to something. I mean, I don't know what that panel is supposed to do. Working together anyway. today, we create a more efficient. Arid. Shut up. Are you okay? I am not a domesticon. Infraction. Just Subject not. <laughs> I'm not here. No target present. Notification system faulty. Faulty, you robotic ass. Equipment activated. Diagnostic equipment. What do you mean with diagnostic equipment? What do you mean with diagnostic equipment? A fully powered security terminal, there is a button marked this new C oh. Oh, 
<laughs> Hello? What are you doing, machine? Am I supposed to be detected to be undetected? Or what? Oh, the door is open. I get it. But this little light is doing nothing. I think it's just like a source of light. Or a way to tell us that, hey, the freaking door is open, so you should head that way. Well, now we are in the diagnostic area. Let's explore because that's the first thing we have to do in a new area. Right? That's a basic game principle. We have to explore. If you don't explore, you're an idiot like me. So. Uh, a security droid is scanning sort of a uh, operating table. How could you op- Well, I was about to say that how could you operate the robot, but I think, you know, operate may be the same word as fixing a robot. Because, you know, if- You know, forget. Let's just keep exploring this place. Wires and cables dangle from gapping holes in the ceiling. I see the cables. For sure. They should. Separated pieces from various security droids. They appear to be working in order. Work in working order. So. Another table with another droid affix. Affixed to it. This is likely designed for repairing and dismantling faulty droids. Yeah, I was right. Repairing. Alright. Alright. Another droid. The stretch from hanging can be detected on these unit joints, but otherwise it seems to be undamaged. There is no evidence that it required diagnostics. Uh, so this droid is working. You're not going to jump at me, either, are you? You better not. I will shoot you in the face. Don't try anything, stupid droid. I'm just a friend. Uh, <laughs> that's not a droid. That's not a droid, uh, for sure. Might be another suit or. For what I can see, a uh, dead human. Which is um, more disturbing than hanging robots. Careful. Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> you heard that? <laughs> that creepy music that came out of the blue. This is a human corpse. He has been dissected in much the same manner as the droids has become decomposing. So somebody confused this human with uh, a robot. I wonder who? <clears throat> the caretaker maybe? Because he's a bad droid. He's a deep purposer. And he wants to deep purpose us as well. Alright, this seems to be the end of the diagnostic area. And then we find we found the corpse and some droids. So maybe right. Oh, you know what? Let me let me, let me, let me see if if the answer to continue is this human. Maybe not. I wonder if he's a woman or a man. I uh, can barely see. I don't think the body has a face, but I can definitely see all the blood, for sure. Alright. Well, what now? Uh...
Can I talk to you? Can I put you down? Oh. The pieces. Nope. Nope. Right. So maybe this little machine is the answer. You can interface with that, are you sure? Maybe... Working together today, we create a more efficient... Arid? Are you okay? Here's something new. Bodies. <laughs> can you mind to explain me why there are dead humans in the diagnostic area? Please. There are bodies in that room. Droids, as well as a dead human. That's a diagnostics room. The tables were used for micro-evaluations when deviant machines couldn't be recalibrated. I saw another human hung in the caverns below. What happened at this facility? I don't know what you saw below. Uh, unlucky scavenger, maybe. We get them now and then. Follow the rules. Your human is in danger. Follow the rules and keep him safe. Er, trust me. Oh, I think um, our uh, little uh, speaker friend is trying to tell us that uh, we we are in danger in this facility. Maybe a lot of deep purposing was made around here when he was working. If you know what I mean, you know, the purpose of humans and machines, which make this a little bit scary and dark for this kind of game. But let's shut up and select this answer, which I don't know what's going to happen. Probably something, but to protect my pilot, I submit myself for evaluation. Good. Enter the elevator to begin simulation. Simulation. <laughs> Simulation for what? I don't want to be a housekeeper robot. Alright. This is a little this is the testing area. Before that let me let me let me try something with this robot. Hang in there a second. together today we create a more I am not infraction on target present notification system faulty diagnostic equipment activated Okay, just forget what I say, it was a stupid idea. And so is. Stupid ideas. I thought that the little machine that was hanging around had something for us, but no. This evaluation will determine whether you are compliant with your function in human society. Enter the house to meet your new owners. You'll need eight merit points. One from each test. Then I can let you upstairs through to medical. You got this. Ah, so now we are up to test. What? You're gonna make us clean the kitchen and make you a sandwich or what? What the hell is that? See that in the background? Look like a slug or something moving around. Before I enter the house, I want to see if there's something around because you never know what you can find look 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 all right, all right. look look uh. uh large observation windows zoomed into the distance that will provide a clear view of this entire area but they are empty 
Maybe because there are no evaluators around here anymore, Arit. Have you ever thought about that? Collapsed debris. My olfactory senses detected a strong smell of ammonia and an identifi identified corrosive compound. Ammonia. Ah. Maybe poison or something like that. I, I'm trying to figure out what happened in this facility. Because, you know, it's kind of a interesting mystery. And if you remember, we are here because we fall from space. Yeah, we had a big fall and now we are here. And we know nothing. Wait a second. An elevator cool button. Level two. I don't think I'm allowed to activate this elevator, or am I? I didn't arrive on that elevator, did I? Uh, I, I think I'm... Um, uh, I'm gonna go back down for just a second. Uh -huh. Because that looks like a... Um, <laughs> like a scary silhouette. It looked like a human, but I'm starting to think that uh, this is going to be a little bit more interesting from now on. Because now we have like an objective to fulfill. To save our pilot, we have to surpass, a, a, I think, a series of obstacles. Okay, there's nothing else here. Seems like not. And to find something by moving my flashlight up and down like a little arid robot and whatever. Forget about that. Shipping box that came through. What a wood. Alright. Let's see what's inside a house. Probably a dead body and some chips and soda. So bits as well, and good music, but more likely a dead body. Oh good, our refurbished droid is here. You will serve my family and I. Understood? Good. The home is a mess since throwing out our old droid. You need to clean upstairs and make this room feel beautiful. Now. Sure, yes, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna clean the house because that what military suits do, right? Yes, of course. I don't like you, stupid robot or whatever you are supposed to represent the man. An empty vase, another was clear table. How am I supposed to clean this place? There, are, there appears to be some sort of a scan device to detect dirt and dust or something like that a crude wooden fa facsimile of a person well a new war for me that I didn't know that it exists most of the paint has long since worn out worn away yeah of course it's been ages since somebody came into this place. A large industrial tub. Right. Use the stairs. I think this is supposed to represent different scenarios 
in real life and the droids were supposed to solve the problems that were told by the humans that they were serving but now this place is just empty and dark and full of death and rotten things and destroyed synthetics it's just remnants Domestic droids must be preemptively aware of what will make their masters feel comfortable. Humans enjoy personalizing their habitats. Always assess how to make your master's home distinctly their own. Request help. Can you assist me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. Humans say a true home has everything it needs. Irrelevant. This is a simulation. Is it? You are not helpful. You are not helpful indeed. Bypass. This is menial. Can I bypass this test? Nope. You need all eight merit points to graduate. Merit points. Huh, sure. Finish. Finish what? I have completed. Evaluating. Alright, seems like not. Processing. No flowers detected. Unit terminated. This gravity shaft must have been designed to remove droids when they fail. Fortunately, I am much heavier than a domestic model. Whoa, whoa, Arid. You don't want to be fired on your first day. Okay. So, destruction is what clears a failed droid's file from the registry. That means you get to keep trying. But be careful. Ah, so we need flowers. Well, how am I supposed to go get that? My God. Flowers to complete the... Let me have a small drink. Ah, alright. Uh, so... Let me see what else is in here. So, there's another... Oh, wait. I see flowers over there. They are purple. Um, we well, I can see the flowers in that simulation. I wonder if upstairs there are going to be more simulations. Yep, there are. Yep. Ooh, it's a crucifix. Plural. <laughs> well, <laughs> whoever made these simulations, they were clearly a little bit crazy. Or very religious, which are not the same thing, of course. Right? Okay, so I'm assuming we have to pick up the flowers from this simulation and put it in the other simulation, or... I will call it a um, uh, stage. I'm gonna keep calling it simulations because I don't remember another word for this correct scenario. Huh. Maybe that will be the right word. Well, whatever. Another scanner, some purple flowers. What is this? A ghoulish wooden family seated around a wooden table. Okay. And there is nothing else in here. Oh, what is that? An old oven. It's completely broken. Yeah, it is completely broken. This room is set up like a simple kitchen. Nothing here is functional. Nothing functional indeed. Right, let's pick up these flowers. Right? Yeah, give me that flowers. This makes really beautiful for all the room. Yeah, of course. Beautiful, beautiful flowers. Right now, purple flowers. Do we succeed in this test? A speaker friend. I think. I think one of the names that he mentioned in the last episode was Hank. I think I'm gonna. gonna, gonna I'm going to call him Hank. It's a cool name. What's it, Hank? I don't remember, but well. Uh, another thing I want to mention is that it's kind of interesting how 
Well, it's not that interesting, but you know, we were lucky that this freaking huge industrial tube was enabled to um, depurpose in us. Thing would be another way to say kill us, because we are not a droid. We are a freaking human being inside a suit with a very sexy voice AI. Yeah, I think that's what we are. Right, Hank. Domestic droids must be preemptively aware of what will make their masters feel comfortable. I know that. enjoy personalizing their habitats. Always assess how to make your master's home distinctly their own. Which, in other words, will be go get some beautiful flowers for this lonely table. And that's what we did. And, you know, these instructions that Hank is told into us, they were like a, kind of a clue. But a very difficult clue, now that I think about it. I have completed the task. Evaluating. I have completed. Come on. Processing. Flowers are of the wrong seasonal color. Unit terminated. I don't think so. <laughs> so, unit terminated. Mmm, go get another flowers. Stupid. Seasonal color. Color. No reason to remove them. Are you sure that there are no reason to remove these pretty flowers? Because I digress. I think I will take those flowers to my home. Are there any flowers up here? I don't think so. And I'm starting to think a palm print DNA scanner. An empty glass jar, I know a speaker, a fake baby script. There's a lot of in the mattress. Ah, slot. A slot for what? Huh. I don't know how many of these freaking trials I'm going to be able to succeed at on this episode, my friends, because. We are in a huge area. We have a bunch of trials in this place, and it's like four trials or oh, whatever. And we have the freaking elevator that is going to take us to another level of this place. I don't remember seeing flowers around here, so uh, probably if I finish the dusting test. I query useful information before I continue exploring. If I finish the dusting test, what do you mean with dusting? Well, Arid, we were able to go to the another level before we enter the house. Why don't you want to go there now? There's something wrong, Arid. You really want to complete the dust test? Dust test. Right, where the hell would I put some flowers of another color? Am I even supposed to collect... I'm even... Am I even supposed to do these stupid trials? I don't know. What if I shoot the flowers? And make, it, make them black? Do I help? <laughs> Maybe not. Come on, Arit. You have to think, Arit. Your uh, intelligent AI. Please tell me what to do. Okay, uh, what if we tried uh, with this next simulation? Probably something else will happen. You will often be required to obtain food for the family. However, Grocery store access has not yet been granted. Rudimentary cleaning should be completed first. Go upstairs and dust. Ah, so we have to dust. Mm hmm. Okay, so there is no specific order of which we have to complete this. So. Alright, let me check this one first. 
Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. Clean this room. Any detected dust will result in termination. Can you assist me? You have been provided with sufficient information. Even our maintenance head couldn't clean this to spec. And his is not a face we'd want to see. Communicate plainly. Any detected dust will result in termination. <laughs> well, that's, 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 you know, an obvious statement. Uh, I will return. So how to clean this place? Right, for sure we have to pick up this jar. This jar is very obvious. Yeah, of course it's going to be useful. Oh, this crucifix. Another body. This corp is older and has decayed significantly. More dead bodies in a crucifix. Which means that uh, they were crazy. Indeed. It's kind of cool that... You know, the sense of perspective that we're getting right here because... You know, the crucifix are in the in a closer plane and our flashlight is being cut off by the silhouettes of the crucifixes which is kind of cool nice detail uh, alright, what about this scanner? I cannot right right right, let me see what about this lock Humans should not concern themselves with basic needs. This room will test your ability to assess and meet your human's requirements when they do not know what they want. An upset baby will emerge from the crib. Without physical contact, comfort the child to make it stop crying. You have 20 seconds per attempt, and multiple attempts are permitted. Corpse. Yeah, tell us about the corpse. I discovered another hung body. What has happened to the humans who ran this facility? The caretaker has made some... modifications. If you fail these evaluations, you, and likely your human, will be depurposed. I will not allow that. Continue your evaluation. Aha! The caretaker. More like Pim taker That guy just wants to run this place by his own. Uh I will return. I think um <laughs> this baby is going to be a difficult task to accomplish. So we need to clean the room. We need to get we need to get food. We need to get different color of flowers. And somehow we need to, you know, the baby thingy. But how do we do that? How do we do that? Corrosive compound. If I use a uh, EMT jar, it doesn't work. Of course not. Or if I should. Always trying to solve a problem with a gun. Yes, yes, indeed. Ah, this is going to be another long episode, I can feel it already. Well, it's long for me because I have to do the investigation. You guys are only going to have like a 15 minutes episode or something like that, but for me are like hours and hours of thinking and playing and all right use your brain what gun use your brain humans should not concern themselves with basic needs this room will test your ability to assess an upset baby will emerge from the crib when you have 20 seconds per attempt, and multiple attempts are... Can you assist me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. How would a military droid make someone be quiet? Oh, all 
right, Hank. I will return. <laughs> well, uh, I think I should have, you know, go to the extreme since the beginning because, well, of course, we're military droid. How could we forget about that? How could we? We cannot should not concern themselves with basic this room will find upset me. You have 20 seconds per attempt and multiple attempts. I am ready to proceed with this test. Ah, oh, little baby. Little baby. I don't like you, little baby. Well, it seems like I was wrong. Maybe not. Or maybe yes. Wait a second. Wait a bit of a second. Human should not this room. Ta -da. You have yeah. 20 seconds mm -hmm. per attempt. I am ready. A fake baby creep. There's a lot in the mattress. No. Sure. Are you sure are it? Are it? All right. Yeah. Ah. Uh, well, we were back to the beginning with nothing to go on. Ah, oh, jeez. Are you kidding me? No way. No way. Plastic shoe covers. Likely used by maintenance crew to keep carpet clean. Plastic shoe covers. What, what is this anyway? Plastic shoe cover. A plastic shoe. Plastic shoe. Cover. Uh, so we found a plastic shoe cover. What could that possibly mean? I keep thinking about this. Classic, um, uh, um, oops, you know that. This has been like 20 minutes and just now I found that freaking plastic shoe cover, which I have no idea for what to use. Yeah. This, no. Um, uh well now we have to figure it out for what do we need the plastic shoe cover okay okay well at least we now have a plastic shoe cover which always it's elemental we we need the plastic shoe cover of course we need we need it but for what i don't know wait wait uh, wait 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 let me see if this is scanner what? No, no, no. Yes. The shoe cover will... We now cover the, the scanner. Now it won't detect the... That the room is not clean. And probably that will solve this stupid... My God. Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. Clean yes. this room. Any detected dust or result in termination. And you were termination, Hank, because I cleaned this room and you don't know that. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Processing. No dust detected. I can breathe again. Get to the kitchen, droid. Validated. Merit point awarded. Yes! Okay, so... 
That freaking plastic shoe cover. I will never forget that those words. The fucking cover. Cover the freaking scanner. Alright, now... Now... We solved one puzzle, now... We have three more to go. <laughs> and it's been like almost like... And now we're in 20 minutes. Oh my god. Let's continue. I know I can figure out another of these puzzles. Come on. Okay, what now now? We're supposed to be in the kitchen. So... There must be something that we have to do here. All aspects of food service are part of a domestic droid's duties. A well-functioning droid belongs in the kitchen. You there, robot. Get my son something to eat. Make it delicious and nutritious. Exit the house and proceed to the grocery store. The grocery store. Well, basically what they say was, Hey, droid, make me a sandwich. You belong to the kitchen. Maybe an inside joke for... Never mind. Never mind. I'm too tired to think about stupid jokes right now because I'm trying to figure out this freaking... Can you assist me with this challenge? Dad? Weren't you programmed to be sensitive? Figure it out. You have been provided with sufficient information. Children can be picky eaters. They don't always want what's best for them. So you mean something delicious but not nutritious, right? I will return. I will return. And I think I know where the grocery store is. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, dear friend, do you are here to kill me? Because you don't stand any chance against Arid. No, seriously, my friend. You stand no chance. Oh! I told you. Oh! There's another one. Getting cover, Arid. Gotcha. Come back. Oh, you saw me. That's not. That's not fair. Stupid droid. Come on, you know you want to be over here. Careful. Careful. I have two guns! Two droids, to be more specific. God! Oh. Well, forget about that. At least we're okay, we're not dead. But something good. Right? This is the way to the grocery store, that's why all these freaking droids were here. And now the door is open, of course. What is this? Small power box. Oh, we might as well check it right now. The panel is mostly functional. One of the wires is broken. Oh, you want a wire, little... Uh, wait. This panel is mostly intact. There's a break in one of the wires. I may be able to replace or patch it. Alright. This place has been ransacked. If there was ever anything useful here, it's gone. It is gone, indeed. No power. Yes, of course. There is no power. Uh, okay. So maybe we have to bring the power back on. A glass plane. Fragile. So fragile that I can break. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Oh. 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 oh, you don't like light. Well, too bad because you're going down. A 
corpse. There's some time of slug like creature up there as well. Lock of there, I can fully reduce your number. Too many slugs. Oh, wait, the, the corpse, a gold coin Drew from that corpse. Gold coin, it is pure gold. Check that out. Green blood is ripped from the slug I shot. That means, obviously, that we need a jar. Because, ha, of course we want slug blood. It's always useful. Sure. Okay. So, is that it? Nothing else in here? Gold coined and some slug blood, that's all we need? Oh, something else is there. Oh, uh, oh, 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 that's dangerous. That's dangerous. It seems there's another one over there that just should answer at me. But I think that's about it. No power. Rubbish. And a box that we need to fix for the power to come back on. And I think that when the power is back on, those slugs will be gone because they don't like light. There's something over here. Oh, it's just a dead droid. I thought it was something important. But it's not. Ha <laughs> um, Trying to think that probably we... We don't have anything that will solve any of these puzzles over here. At least not, not yet. Unless they want gold or some glass filled with cream blood. No, I suppose that. Huh. Or the silver. Oh, okay, so. Trying to think, trying to think. So probably we now have to go to the second floor and use the elevator. This is the only thing that comes to my mind, but I'm not sure if we are going to be able to use it. Okay, we are. Right, let's see what we can find in the second level. So we were here some time ago, a couple of minutes, or a lot of minutes, and... Yeah. Oh, you know what, that's, that's another wooden person thingy. I think that's what it is. Another wooden person, I don't know what's seen in the overalls. An unpowered... Oh, this is another scenario that we have to complete, but there is no power on the on the thingy, the speaker. An ancient vehicle, very mechanically simple. Yeah, very simple. Everything simple for you, are it? Isn't it? Another wooden person. This child is covered in fungus. Well, that's that's unfortunate. A child covered in fungus. What an interesting vision that came to my mind, a very disgusting one. Another makeshift stand. There's no body in this one. Oh, that, well, that's, that's actually fortunate. Another house. More wooden people. It's really... Look at this atmosphere, it looks... So creepy and abandoned, so many remnants and darkness and... Oh, 
Well, obviously, these are... This... As I was saying, uh, these are obviously more trials that we need to complete, but right now there is no power in this section. No power in this section of the facility. So... Must be something in here that we can use to solve the puzzles in the floor below, but what? Backup generator activated. Hey, hey, things are really coming along. I am completing these tasks efficiently. Groovy. Efficiently. I used to sound like you. Perhaps your vocal matrix requires maintenance. Thank you for the recommendation. Internal scan initiated. Uh, no. Internal scan aborted. I've spent the better part of these last 30 years perfecting my authentic human sound. Where I can. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, an interesting personality is Hank Machine, or Speaker. Uh, human sound. Second floor power. Let's ask about your voice, my friend. Why do you attempt to emulate human grammar and tonality? Because. The closer we get to them, the more we get treated like them. And I've been bored. Ah, uh, treated like humans. Oh, you know what? This sounds to me like, like, like Terminator machines taking control over the humans, taking over the world, and this planet that we are, which to me seems a little bit weird. But, yeah, I think that's about it. Machines trying to control humans. The civic area has no power. I will not be able to initiate the test here. Please utilize your generator so I may proceed. Oops, I'm sorry. The power for the speaker is not sufficient to activate the civic testing area. Oops. Well, that's groovy, Hank. So groovy. Oh, groovy, groovy. I must return to my current task. One thing. Why do you think you're here? Oh, wait, 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 yeah. Why the hell are we here? I mean, we know for sure that the pilot inside the suit was sent to a mission. And then we fall from the sky and then now we are here. Uh, interesting question. Acknowledge what? I do not know. Makes you wonder. Relatively small facility in an ever-expanding galaxy. If I were malfunctioning, I would have been sent to a military-grade facility, not a domestic repurposing depot. Not accusing, just saying. Nobody previously ended up here if they were working to spec. Irrelevant. Totally. Irrelevant. Totally. <laughs> this These words that that these machines and AIs are using, depurposing, groovy, irrelevant. So, so... confounding. <laughs> that would be the right word. <laughs> I mean, who use the word groovy anymore? Oh, look at this place, it's so groovy. Well, I mean, scary, yeah, that's what I meant to say. I think uh, there's nothing in here. Maybe another test that we can't do because there is no power. Mm. Uh, this seems like a locked door. Oh, broken ID tag reader. It says maintenance in a small text. Oh, wait. Oh, where the hell are we? Large wire cutters. A note left hanging on the wall. Uh, wait, what is that? A rusted tire iron. And a workbench. I don't 
a number of tools for removing bolts, bending wire, and similar tasks. An OID tech reader. A flat panel display screen. Ah. Well, obviously we have to pick some of these things up. And this seems like the main entrance for the... You know, the... The droids that were supposed to solve these real-life scenarios when they become housekeeping machines but um, you know what it's been quite a long time since I started this episode and I'm getting tired but I have to mention this game and these puzzles oh my god it took me like 20 minutes to find the plastic shoe covers <laughs> because why where else would you put those freaking covers but in the most uh, irrelevant, irrelevant place the way you came in that was genius but yeah I think that's about it's about that's about this episode I can I can't even talk uh, but yeah this game is <laughs> it's pretty good so yeah I will see you guys in the next episode